Hello and welcome to the Hardison and Cochran podcast. In today's episode, North Carolina Workers' Compensation Board Certified Specialist Attorney Ben Cochran discusses three key actions injured North Carolina workers need to be aware of to ensure that their North Carolina workers' comp claim continues to go as smoothly as possible. Now, here's Ben Cochran. In order for you to make sure that you're doing what you're supposed to do for your workers' compensation claim, number one is compliance. And what I mean by that is, is that make sure you are attending all of your medical appointments as directed by the physicians. If they recommend an MRI, make sure you go to the MRI. If they recommend physical therapy, make sure you're participating in physical therapy. If you're having trouble getting transportation to either of those circumstances, contact the adjuster and ask for transportation to be provided. The number one thing the insurance company wants to show is that you are not being compliant and as such, they should not have to provide additional benefits. Second, make sure that you are detailed with your physicians and with your medical providers in general as to what's going on physically. If you injured your neck and your shoulder, make sure when you first go to the doctor, you let the doctors know it's your neck and your shoulder. Fight for medical treatment for everything that is injured. Unfortunately, if it comes up three months later because they focused on the neck and not the shoulder, the insurance company will say, whoa, 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 whoa. Nobody mentioned anything about the shoulder. We're not gonna provide compensation for that now. So make sure that you are very, very detailed and letting the medical providers know what's going on with you physically. And lastly, don't be afraid to ask. If you're uncertain as to why something's being done, ask. If it's from the doctor, ask the doctor. If the nurse case manager, if you have one, if they indicate something to you and you're confused as to why, ask. If the insurance company tells you to do something and you're not comfortable with it, ask. If they're not doing something that you've requested, ask why they're not doing it. And if you don't feel comfortable with any of the responses that you're getting, give me a call, ask me. I'll tell you whether or not what's happening in your case is in the best interest of you. We'd like to thank you for listening to the Hardison and Cochran Attorneys at Law podcast. If you would like a free consultation about you or a loved one's legal situation, please go to LawyerNC.com. For a full list of episodes, please visit LawyerNC.com slash podcast. Listening to this podcast does not create an attorney-client relationship between you and Hardison and Cochran. Hardison and Cochran does not accept new clients until obtaining a signed agreement. This podcast is for informational purposes only and should not be intended or taken as legal advice. If you have a legal matter, Contact a licensed attorney in your state about your specific set of circumstances.